Hello everyone, welcome to this lecture. I am Amlan Das. Now I am going to discuss about London penetration depth. Okay. We know what is Meissner effect. When a superconductor is cooled below its critical temperature and is placed in an external magnetic field, it is observed that the magnetic flux or magnetic lines of force is expelled from inside the superconductor. And this phenomenon is known as Meissner effect. So, according to Meissner effect, magnetic field inside the superconductor is zero. But it is not true in the case of thin films. It is observed that inside the superconductor, magnetic field does not abruptly zero. And it is seen that inside the superconductor, magnetic field decays exponentially and it penetrates a finite distance as we move from the surface to inside the superconductor. Okay. So in reality, it is seen that magnetic field inside the superconductor penetrates a finite distance from the surface and this distance is known as London penetration depth. So let us derive London penetration depth. Okay. Now from Maxwell's equation we know that curl of B is equals to mu 0 j plus mu 0 epsilon 0 del E del T. Okay. So this is a Maxwell's equation. Now, for electrostatic case, here del E del T equals to 0. Okay. So, for super electron, this Maxwell's equation can be written as For super electron, this Maxwell's equation can be written as curl of B is equals to mu 0 into Js. Okay. Suppose this is equation 1. So this is Maxwell's equation. Now taking curl on both sides of this equation. Taking curl on both sides of equation 1, we get curl of curl of B is equals to mu 0 into curl of Js. Okay. Suppose this is equation 2. Now we know that curl of curl of B is equals to grad of divergence B minus grad square B. Okay. We know that curl of curl of B is equals to grad of divergence B minus grad square B. So, using this equation 2 can be written as so, equation 2 is grad of divergence B minus grad square B is equals to mu 0, sorry, uh, mu 0 into curl of Js. Okay. Suppose this is, okay. So, this is, uh, equation 2 can be written as this. Now, here, we know that divergence B equals to 0. From Maxwell's equation, we know that divergence B is equals to 0. So, using this, this equation can be written as minus grad square B is equals to mu 0 into curl of Js. Okay. Suppose this is equation 3. Now, from London second equation, we know that from 
लंडन लंडन सेकेंड इक्वेशन वी गेट कार्ल ऑफ जेस इज इक्वल्स टू माइनस एन एस स्क्वायर बाय एम इनटू बी वेक्टर ओके फ्रॉम लंडन सेकेंड इक्वेशन वी नो दैट कार्ल ऑफ जेस इज इक्वल्स टू माइनस एन एस स्क्वायर बाय एम इनटू बी सपोज दिस इज इक्वेशन फोर ओके सो फ्रॉम इक्वेशन थ्री एंड फोर वी गेट माइनस ग्रेड स्क्वायर बी इज इक्वल्स टू माइनस म्यू जीरो एन एस स्क्वायर बाय एम इनटू बी ओके और दिस कैन बी रिटर्न एस ग्रेड स्क्वायर बी इज इक्वल्स टू म्यू जीरो एन एस स्क्वायर बाय एम इनटू बी ओके और दिस कैन बी रिटर्न एस ग्रेड स्क्वायर बी इज इक्वल्स टू This can be written as one by lambda square. Okay, so this is one by lambda square into b vector, or grad square b minus b by lambda square equals to zero. Okay. Suppose this is equation five. So we get grad square b minus b by lambda square equals to zero. Where well, lambda is equals to m by mu zero n s e square to the power half. Okay. Where well, lambda is m by mu zero n s e square to the power half. Lambda is the dimension of length, and it is called London penetration depth. Okay. So lambda has dimension of length, and it is called London penetration depth. London penetration depth. Now, for one dimension, equation five can be written as for one dimension. For one dimension, equation five can be written as del to b del x to minus b by lambda square equals to zero. Okay. Now suppose this is equation six, and the solution of this equation can be written as b x is equals to some constant b zero into e to the power. Minus x by lambda. Okay, the solution of equation six can be written as b x is equals to b zero e to the power minus x by lambda. Okay, here b zero is the magnetic field at the surface of the superconductor. Okay, so here b zero is the magnetic field, magnetic field at the surface. At the surface of the superconductor. So here we will see that b is exponentially decaying from the value b zero. Okay, so b is exponentially decaying from the value b zero. Now here x is the length inside the superconductor. So for x equals to lambda this equation can be written as b lambda is equals to b0 into e to the power minus lambda by lambda okay so this is equals to b0 e to the power minus 1 so we get b lambda is equals to b0 by e so now here b0 is the magnetic field at the surface of the superconductor so we can say that at the distance x equals to lambda the value of magnetic field inside the superconductor is 1 by e times 
the value of magnetic field at the surface okay now let us represent it graphically okay so let us represent it, it graphically suppose this is x axis and this is y axis and along the x axis we plot depth of penetration x okay so this is depth of penetration x and along y axis we plot magnetic field b okay and suppose this is b0 that is value of magnetic field at the surface okay so along the x axis we plot depth of penetration x and along the y axis we plot magnetic field v and this is the b0 that is value of magnetic field at the surface now here b is exponentially decaying so we will get this type of graph okay So we will get this type of graph that is exponentially decrease now at x equals to lambda okay suppose this is x equals to lambda so x at x equals to lambda value of b is b0 by e so this is b0 by e so this is exponent this graph represents the exponential decrease of magnetic field inside the superconductor okay so london penetration depth is defined as the distance inside the superconductor from the surface where magnetic field gets reduced to 1 by e times the value of magnetic field at the surface okay so we can say that london penetration depth is the distance inside the superconductor from the surface where magnetic where magnetic field gets reduced to 1 by e times the value of magnetic field at the surface okay so this is london penetration depth so thus we discuss london penetration depth okay thank you for watching this video